New at 5 tonight, community concern over a tent encampment for the unhoused in the city's West Loop. Nearby neighbors joining in online CAPS meeting this afternoon to discuss complaints about alleged drug activity and other issues. Evelyn Holmes reporting tonight from the West Loop. During that CAPS meeting, concerned residents express frustration and anger about the situation and say they want something done now about this encampment. Some residents in this West Loop community say the streets and sidewalks in their neighborhood have become unsafe ever since a homeless encampment sprung up under the viaducts near Fulton and Clinton streets. There are fights happening in the street. There is people standing, you know, clearly under the influence of drugs. Um, and so it just creates an atmosphere. Fred Gomos and others say they've seen drug deals, drug use and other unsettling behavior and that they are scared. One day I experienced a man running at me and I had no pepper spray or anything on me, so it was a little bit scary. Neighbors say it was about a year ago when they noticed a growing number of unhoused people beginning to gather in the area along Lake Street. Soon after, more makeshift shelters began popping up, crowding sidewalks, and so did plenty of garbage and debris. It's more of the smell, if anything, it's like, it just, they just sleep in their own, you know, dirt and nobody ever care enough to come help them clean it up. But many of the concerns say the real problems began when a non-for-profit began giving all weather tents to people there. The Orange Tent Project has provided around 200 shelters along with food for those in need all over the city and say that they are only trying to help people stay alive. We want to help. Uh, the question is, how can we get these folks into more permanent housing? And that's kind of a bureaucratic uh, mess. The viaducts are located in Alderman William Conway's 34th Ward. In an email statement, he writes, this situation isn't safe for anyone. I'm in close contact with our Chicago police commanders to address illegal activity in the area. My office has been working with Streets and Sanitation and DFSS to remove abandoned tents and provide additional support for the individuals living there as well. Little comfort to some who want a long-term solution hoping that it will return safety and security to the neighborhood. Hopefully they get moved out. Um, they need to go somewhere. This is not good for the residents in West Loop here. Um, and who knows what it's going to do for, for property values, of course. Everyone agrees there is no quick fix. This is they continue to look for a long-term solution. Reporting from Chicago's West Loop, Evelyn Holmes, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.